Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, good evening, good evening, good evening. And welcome. Welcome to everyone here. Oh, thanks, Jerry. Welcome to everyone here this beautiful Friday evening at Chiro's Pizza Pavadora. Welcome. My name is Jen, and we have Uber here. Yeah. We're going to give you some music tonight. We have four sets, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be a very long night. Four sets that we have to get through. We're going to start nice and easy, then we're going to build it up. Then we're going to go fast, fast, and you can dance and do what you like to do. But we want to celebrate everybody in here individually. So first of all, we're not going to do this. We're just making inquiries first. So we just need to find out. Do we have any birthday people in the house? What's your favourite art have you done? Uh, this My favourite art is like next to me. Hi Chelsea, how's your day going? Yeah, not too bad. I've been sleeping all day, innit? And then I'm just gonna, I was trying to do the leaderboard now. Yeah. Um, um, but yeah, where's Mr. TikTok? Did he go? Your skin looks loads better. Thank you, darling. 
Um, what happened to your spaghetti bolognese? I've got to still cook it. Everything always happens to me. I'm like, do you, do you understand? Like, yeah, I do know. I do know. I just feel yeah. like I try yeah. and do good stuff. And then people always, like, trigger me or something happens. Like, you know. Just, I just have to chill and relax. Yeah, this is it. Just, just rise above it. Just rise above it, absolutely Definitely. rise above it. That's why I can't drink alcohol and that because, you know, like, it's just mad. Mm, it's crazy, then. What have you been drinking? Absolutely nothing. We just had a non-alcoholic drink. To be honest, the place where we went was really good. They had, um, we had three drinks, two mocktails, one alcoholic drink, three pizzas, and it was less than 100 quid. So, and I was saying to Alfred, well, when I went to that place, I'm so glad that we never went there then, because yeah. it could probably would have charged us about 200 quid. Mm-hmm. Just for a fucking drink and she shit thing. Because yeah. it cost me, for all I had was one mocktail, which was just like pineapple juice, yeah. one cup of tea, yeah. and she shot, and it came to 96 pounds. And everyone on the live was going, 96 pounds, yeah. wow. I'm sure they ripped me off in there as well. You never do anything good. Well, I've done pretty well, sweetheart. I'm in the lion leaderboard. I got whales, lions. I made about 100k diamonds in an hour. So get jealous, get affected. I'm 30 odd in the leaderboard, sweetheart. 36 in the leaderboard. I've made all the cash today. So that's why I thought I'd uh, go out for a little pizza and that. Yeah, that's really nice. <laughs> and celebrate. And uh, I'm bringing out my business. My uh, business is about to launch as well. So there we go. We'll have all the positivity, Chelsea. Absolutely. You deserve it. I certainly do, darling. I feel like a um, cup of tea or something now. I think we're gonna have a cup of tea, darling. <laughs> It is hard though sometimes. Yeah, it really is. I sp- I find that with the weed is the hardest thing. And then I was thinking, oh, if I go to Spain or Barcelona, but then I was thinking there's no point because I'll be so tempted to smoke when I get out there. Yeah, because, you know, and I don't want to, and I've really no. got to just be strict with myself now. Yeah, yeah. It's all my art, darling. You look really well, thank you guys. Yeah, don't go. Yeah, no, I'm not doing... My eyebrows are, like, bloody... They're, like, flaking, so... uh... But she said they go through a stage like this because it's a tattoo thing or whatever. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because, like, just with, like, any any tattoo, if they're healing, it'll start flaking, and then... And then the colour... And then it comes out after us and that. So... I might need to get them done again or something to make them darker or I don't know. Have to wait and see. But yeah, we'll just have to see. But I do like them a bit darker to be honest. Mm. But they look alright, innit? Yeah, they're dark. What yeah. skin is so clear? Well, it's not too bad. Maybe I got bit when I was on the bed because I have the windows open. I've yeah. been sleeping in the daytime. I was gonna say, I think it when you're asleep. Yeah, it does, man. The uh, healing, yeah, it must be a healing. I, I'll read about it anyway. I mean, she gave me a leaflet, but I just mm. don't know what I did with the bloody leaflet. <laughs> um, I'm with Maria. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm with Maria and Alpha. There she is. Uh, <laughs> she's lost, you've lost loads of weight. She's lost so much weight. <laughs> you have though, like, I think you've definitely I lost... Um, going to the gym again, actually. Yeah. yeah. So oh, darling. <laughs> Let's put... Let me see if I can... in the gym? Uh, sauna. All right, yeah. Uh, treadmills. Really? Weight lifting. Really? Yeah. Oh, weightlifting. Wow. And swimming. Yeah, swimming's really good. Yeah. My fucking setup's terrible. That's 
push this down a bit. That's it. Yeah, man. Oh, darling. Where's the tuners gone? Oh, they both look very well tonight. Yeah, absolutely. And Thank Alpha's you. skin looks amazing. I can't oh, believe it. All her skin has just cleared up so much. She ain't even got like spots or nothing no more. Spot ball has disappeared. She's gone. <laughs> like... <laughs> I'm, I'm going to my Glinda witch arrow. <laughs> oh, darling. Like... Thank you everyone, darling. Did you have spaghetti bolognese? No, I'm gonna go, I was gonna go cook it. Cause don't forget, I've been sleeping all day, innit? So I'm, then I'm awake all night. Right, yeah. Because I can't really sleep in this house on the night time. Um, I yeah. find it difficult, so I'll just sleep in the daytime. Yeah. You look so happy. Thank you, darling. I did just get a bit stressed in the pizza place because they told me to come offline and then the woman came over and took a picture of my TikTok and said that they've had complaints of the customers about us saying something online. I was like, what? So I did, I got affected. I know I shouldn't say anything, but I am doing. And and it's just like, oh, you know, so I got vexed and so I've just, it's like, I'm, I'm doing nothing wrong, darling, but he would, the, the guy was just saying, and it? We were like, we don't want anyone live streaming. It's a private place, this, yeah, that, and the other. Fine. So, yeah, it's all my fault once again. But fuck it, I'm not going out and live streaming nowhere no more because I can't do anything no more. And I only did it because I thought, I mean, the leaderboard and the cameras was on us, so it's not like we was filming anyone or anything. But like I said, it's all right when other people are in there taking videos for the Instagram and taking pictures and all this and that, you know. So what's the fucking difference? Um... Yeah, so it's probably trolls calling up in it again. Like, whatever, man. No one gives a fuck no more. I won't go back in there, darling. The pizza not, so pizzas are not all that anyway, darling. It's ridiculous. Yeah, but for her to... The woman, she actually took a picture on my TikTok and goes, which account? Like, that got me angry because yeah, yeah. at the end of the day, yeah, like, what the fuck, sweetheart? Like, first the guy's coming over saying you're not allowed to, to stream. And then the girl's saying that they've had complaints about some out with customers. Like, we've done fuck all wrong, sweetheart. And this is why I get affected and I get angry. And it's just, yeah. Because what you do, trolls, you try and just fucking ruin everything. You try phone up, talk shit all the time, wherever we are. And I've had a fucking enough, darling. And if these fucking restaurants want to listen to any more bastard trolls, darling, then fuck you all, darling. I won't go fucking nowhere. Don't think that I'm that bothered about that dusty place anyway, because no dusty place anyway, because no one gives a fuck about the fucking shit pizzas, darling. I mean, it's full of fucking students in there anyway. Do you know what I mean? I'll go and eat halal food. I'll go to Mohammed's. No one gives a fuck when and the trolls phone up. He tells them to F off. He probably doesn't even answer the phone. So I'll go places where they don't care, darling, and I can live stream and they don't treat me like shit. So, yeah, what about that one, darling? Yeah, I don't want that. They, all, they eat bare pork. I had to have the fucking barbecue chicken anyway, darling. No one wants to go there, darling. No one eats no pork anyway. We did it. No one cares if you did it. What do you want? A round of applause, darling. The place is shit anyway. That's why I don't even go there hardly any time. So, so what? Oh, Ruth, stop. Right, you fuck off. Because I've had enough. Now, fuck off. Do you understand that? Fuck off. Do you understand? F off. <laughs> Fuck off, darling. Don't even let me start running up my gums because I fucking will do, sweetheart. Yes, 4.K uh, in the place. Absolutely, darling. We'll have all the views. I think I'll make a cup of tea. Do you want a cup of tea? Yeah. Oh. We'll have a nice cup of tea. Honestly, yeah. I can't let these people affect me. In fact, I'll push this button. 
I'm not going to let these fuckers affect me. But they do, man. It's like fucking the restaurants as well. What are you going to do when you've got famous people in there and they phone up because they want... But the, I forgot, famous people don't live stream, do they? They're already fucking rich, aren't they? They don't need to come live stream on TikTok, do they? There you go. So I'm treated shit like shit because I'm a fucking TikToker. And I'm, I am only went on there because I'm doing the leaderboards. You understand? Fuck me. You can never do anything right, Chelsea. The moment you try to do something right, this is what happens. Fuck you Fucking jealous little tramps on TikTok phoning up places, man. I should go and fucking phone the police, say I've been to Pizza Paladora, got trolls phoning up on me. You need to go and fucking investigate the calls because I've had enough of you fucking not doing fuck all, darling. And find out who you are, you dusty utes. What about that? I don't know. I mean, always kind of stress me out when I, like Alpha Bars come, Maria. You always try and fucking try and fuck up my vibe with summer or do summer or, you know what I mean? Even in Mayfair, phoning up the hotel, this, that. You know what I mean? I'm going to report you, man. I've had enough. I'm being harassed everywhere I go, darling. And all I'm trying to do is make a living. All I'm trying to do is make a living for myself, but it's too much, so the police needs to go and investigate who's calling up and doing on this, because I've had enough. I don't think you'll get away with it, because I'll get a private fucking detective if I have to be, darling. Uh, you can hack into everything and do everything, darling. That like your voice on the phone, you know what I mean? Sad bastards. You know what it is though? It all comes down to jealousy because I'm a big fucking celebrity and you're an absolute nobody that sat in your dusty yard with your dusty fucking furniture. Jealous and hating on me because I'm in fucking eating Italian pizza. Fuck you, darling. What about that? Tramps. You're the tramps, not me, darling. You can't even afford to go out in London, Knightsbridge. Power to on the corner, eat fucking pieces, all the celebrities have been in there. They're gonna say to me, darling, so get back to your fucking 299 pizzas, darling. The Observer, providing you with the latest TikTok drama from across the UK.